Scorpio. I hope you guys are doing awesome. Happy holidays. Whatever it is you're celebrating, I hope you're going to have an awesome time with your family, your loved ones. So, Scorpio, you want to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. So we're going to do that, uh, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. The first part of the video, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, Scorpio, and how you're currently doing on the soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate. <clears throat> we're going to ask what's going on with your soulmate at this time, how they are relating to you emotionally, and what's on their mind, what they're thinking, feeling especially in relation to you, Scorpio. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Scorpio, for Scorpio's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards Scorpio? What will Scorpio be dealing with, facing? Uh, how to best handle it for the highest good? And how is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey? How is Scorpio doing on this soulmate journey? What's coming up? For Scorpio, <clears throat> this one wants to strongly come out as extra message. Wow, Scorpio, this is you very disappointed right now, emotionally, heartbroken, sad, regretful. This is often called crying over spilled milk. So this is you very heartbroken. <sighs> yeah, disappointed currently in your soulmate relationship and you're not releasing this person. You're not letting them go. So you feel this is unfinished <clears throat> business with them. This is you very disappointed, but you're not releasing them. Uh, not ready, perhaps, to let them go yet. Let me see what's going on. Yeah, you see disappointments, arguments, misunderstandings, problems with communication indicated here. Yeah, you feel alone, neglected, rejected, um, left out in the cold. You miss this person, though. So... Uh, there are some uh, things about them that you definitely miss, even though you are disappointed right now. This is very powerful combination to show up in the same spread. So here we have out of four cards, we have this combination, five of cups, five of pentacles. This is you heartbroken, feeling uh, not in a relationship with this person right now, missing them, not able to release them at this time. Yeah, this is you checking up on them, but this person is not coming through with communication. This is you waiting for some kind of important communication from this person, some kind of sign of what's going on. Let me see. Universe, please show us what's coming towards Scorpio. And in a few minutes, we're going to ask about your soulmate. What's coming towards Scorpio? How is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey? Yeah, you're not sure where this is going. You have questions, no answers. Hmm. Yeah, you see, this has been toxic. This is showing up as devil energy with, with um, the moon card. So this is you uncertain what is going on at this time. You have a lot of questions. This has been unbalanced between the two of you. Toxic. Uh, energy showing up here for some reason yeah this is you trying to make sense of what's going on yeah not communicating this is you very much guarding your heart um so you possibly told them off in the past or told them harshly how you felt um this is you feeling like you're not going to communicate right now. Yeah, like you have no desire to communicate at this time. Like you don't want to reach out right now. Yeah. <clears throat> this is you. Yeah, this is a soul contract you have with this person. So the two of you have soul lessons are learning. That the two of you are learning from each other. Um, this has been challenging for both of you though. This relationship has been very challenging for these cards to show up. The Five of Cups, Five of Pentacles, the Moon, and the Devil. Yeah, you feel like some major change needs to happen. <clears throat> yeah, this person has been in and out of your life, Scorpio. They have not been consistent. Yeah, they have been in and out of your life. Not consistent. Um, you have a lot of questions, no answers. Wow, let's see what's going on here. And we're going to go directly into the energy because you have the right to know. 
you're still holding on to some kind of hope idea for some kind of resolution. Let's see, universe, please show us what's coming towards Scorpio. What will Scorpio be dealing with facing and how is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey? Yeah, you see, you're showing up here as extremely guarded, not communicating, very sad, uh, guarding your heart. Yeah, disappointed, highly, not reaching out right now to this person. Yeah, you're curious what's going on, what they're thinking, what they're feeling. You're very heartbroken. Scorpio, um, this is heartbreak that's showing up as a result. So, yeah, this is you very much protecting your heart, very disappointed in this person and in this situation at this time. I'm not sure if they're aware how highly disappointed you are because you're not communicating with them. Your sword is pointing south. It, and right above it, you have three of swords, heartbreak. So I don't know if they really understand how deeply disappointed or heartbroken you are at this time. Yeah, you see? Fights, disagreements, arguments, uh, no communication, problems with communication, Wow, I'm so sorry you're going through this, Scorpio. Let's see what's going on with this person. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Scorpio. For Scorpio's highest good, please. Universe, the soulmate of Scorpio. The soulmate of Scorpio. What is going on with the soulmates of Scorpio at this time? And how is the soulmate of Scorpio currently relating to Scorpio, especially emotionally? And what's on soulmate's mind? The soulmate of Scorpio. Oh, this one wants to come out very strongly as extra. Wow. This person is reminiscing about you, thinking of you, very emotional towards you, checking up on you any way they can, whether it's through videos like this, social media, through your job or business, this person is checking up on you. They're keeping tabs on you, thinking of you, reminiscing, very emotional towards you. And this also shows past life connection with this person. Yeah, you see? Again, they're showing up as Knight of Wands from another deck this time. So this person has been inconsistent in your life. Yeah. They have disappointed you greatly. Whether they acknowledge that or not, the fact is that... Their behavior has disappointed you greatly. They've been in and out, in and out, non-committal, wishy-washy, not communicating effectively, not coming through. Yeah, very immature energy when it comes to their action. Yeah, you see? This person showing up here as very proud, not communicating easily their feelings, emotions. This is them not communicating easily their feelings. This person doesn't like to communicate feelings, emotions. Yeah. Um, their pride is not allowing them to communicate. Yeah. They feel those emotions and feelings deeply. They just don't like to show it or communicate it or verbalize it. Universe, please show us what is going on with this soulmate of Scorpio. And how is the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio? See, they're waiting to see what you're going to do. Not giving up on you. Yeah, very attracted to you, loving towards you, but they have, yeah, you see, they know. So they are aware. They're not silly. They they know. They're aware of what's, what needs to change. They know they need to become from Knight of Wands to Knight of Pentacles. Reliable, consistent, communicating with you, coming through. Yeah. This is opposite energy. They know. So they're aware what changes they need to make. But yet their pride is stopping them from reaching out to you. This person is waiting, hoping to get communication from you. Yeah. So the two of you consider yourself single at this time. Meaning if somebody were to ask you or them if the two of you are in relationship right now, you would say no. This person is very attracted to you and they realize that other people are interested in you. Somehow they know other people are interested in you. You are showing up here as attractive, independent. Yeah, people are attracted to you, Scorpio. 
this person hopes to have long-term relationship with you. They love you, but they're not coming through. They're not meeting you halfway to have that relationship that they've been hoping for. You see, here's 10 of Pentacles on top of six of cups. They want to have that relationship because they love you deeply. And uh, here it is, them not having that relationship. And when you add the nine of pentacles with ace of pentacles, you show up with ten of pentacles. They're hoping to have that. But if you add seven of pentacles with ace of pentacles, it means that they know other people are looking at you also. Um, hmm. Yeah, you see, they want reconciliation. That's what they want. Yeah, they're waiting on communication from you, though. They're waiting on you to communicate. They're hoping for reconciliation, but they know for that reconciliation to happen, they have to come in with this responsible, grounded energy, not wishy-washy, knight of wands, gigolo energy, in and out, uh, non-committal, in your life, then next week, out of your life. So this person... This person is not consistent. Yeah, they know that. They do know that. So let's see what's going on here. Universe, please show us what's going on with the soulmate. What is going on with the soulmate of Scorpio universe? Yeah, this person has a lot going on on the plate right now. This person doesn't want to fight or argue. They're not giving up on you, though. They can't walk away from you. Like, they have a hard time releasing you. This person is not giving up. They're hoping, wishing, praying for communication to come through. But they know eventually they're going to have to reach out if you don't. They love you. This person loves you. Yeah, but you guys are single. You guys are not together in a relationship with this person. Um, but they're very serious about you. It's like they can't stop thinking of you. They can't stop loving you. Um, Scorpio, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's current, true, long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. Then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you at this time. What they have up their sleeve, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can't communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you from universe, from spirit on how to best handle the summit connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, whether it's your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know. They'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Scorpio, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below. And I'll see you there. Love you guys.